Maximize your efficiency as a Medicare agent with Agent CRM. Hey guys, Luis Moreno here. I am with Alex Branding, CEO of Agent CRM. Welcome, Alex. Hey, Louis, thank you so much for having me, man. I am so excited to be showing Medicare agents what you've got for Agent CRM and what they're going to get when they sign up for a free trial. Like I just, what you've put together is like a Medicare agent business in a box. So let's show them what you built. It is, it is. So we're going to start off, guys. We're going to, Alex, talk about, well, what is Agent CRM? So Alex, I'm going to let you take it away here. Awesome. Agent CRM was started over three years ago by us and our entire intent of building this was how can we create a marketing platform so that insurance agents can grow their business and we are the now the fastest growing marketing platform in the world and the reason is for three reasons one we've got world-class support which i know lewis will talk about later he loves our support options we're there for you 24 7 and we have twice a day zoom calls the second reason we're so successful is because we have everything unlocked we have email marketing, SMS marketing, an online booking system. That means that you don't need separate tools for like Calendly and then your email marketing and then a text messaging service. It's all in one. Inside of Agent CRM, we also have a funnel builder. So you don't need click funnels anymore. We have a pipeline so you can see a visual representation of your sales and so many more. But the third reason why people love Agent CRM is because we have made it so easy for you to get a return on your investment by building out our click and play library, but also by partnering with agents like Lewis who build out systems inside of Agent CRM to help their business. And then we partner with them in giving away what they've created for themselves. And so that's what Lewis is doing here when you sign up for his affiliate link. So it's all tracked to him. You are going to get everything that he's about to show you that he's put together to run his Medicare business. So Lewis, Let's show them what you've put together for your Medicare business and how you not only use it to generate leads, but then nurture those leads and get them signed up and onboarded as a new Medicare client. Beautiful. Yes, I am excited. God, I love doing this stuff. <laughs> Guys, all right. So they're like, well, who, who is this guy? Why do we have to? So number one, I've been in agent since 99. Okay, so I've been around the block. Okay, um, I've got a very good, healthy Medicare book of business. I've got approximately a thousand Medicare clients, uh, probably 90% of a Medicare Advantage, 10% MedSup, and it's a beautiful business, but I'm not a one-man show, okay? I have got, I'm a multi-line agency, so we do Medicare, we do ACA, we do auto insurance, home insurance, life insurance, commercial insurance, but... Uh, I pretty much can do it all, okay? Uh, and I've got a wonderful team. I can't do it all, but I've got a wonderful team. So we deal with, with all the lines of insurance that are out there. So with that, guys, on my Medicare side, been doing that for a while. So with a healthy book of business, there's a couple of things that you need to do. Number one, we as agents know we've got to be certified to sell this. We're super knowledgeable. And all of us have every carrier that's available in, in the areas that we're marking. So we're going to take that off the table. What is it that you do to bring in clients? And, mm -hmm. and so I'm going to share with you the one of many tools that I'm going to give you when you use my affiliate link. Okay. Yeah. So let's hop right in here. And this tool that I, that I use here, this is what I call my warm up the lead flow workflow. Okay. So I do a lot of social media advertising, okay? I, I do grassroots just like all of you do, but nothing beats the power of advertising out there in social media, okay? Mainly Facebook and Instagram. So I create ads, put them out there. And one of the issues that I was having was when the lead was created, I had really nothing, nothing would happen, guys, okay? Mm. Uh, you know, I'd have to go back into Facebook and grab the lead, but... I was, I, you know, I was just too busy throughout the day. And so by the time I'm like, oh, let me go check my leads, they got, they got cold on me. Okay. So the beauty of this workflow is that agent CRM is listening for that lead. Okay. Pays attention. Once it hears that a lead has, has been created or somebody clicked on your ad and they shared their information, it does a few things, guys. Okay. Number one, it creates an opportunity. Okay. And what is that? 
That is your tag. That is your visual representation of, think of it as a big board and with a bunch of stickies and all these people's names are on these stickies. You're tracking where they're at. And so you, you'll, yep. you'll see all these leads here. So it's a good visual representation. It also gives them a tag and it, and it attaches a note. I love tags and I'm going to share with you in a little while why you want to tag them. That's giving these people a label. It's also assigned to a user. And then this is what I love. This right here, guys. It sends me and my assigned user an email and a text. And I'm going to share what the text looks like. It says, hey, we just got a Facebook lead. Here's their name, phone number, and email. I could be out grocery shopping, Alex, and I see it. And I'm like, <laughs> click. Alex, you were just on Facebook requesting information on Medicare. How can I help you? Instant, while it's still hot. And then I realize that there's an addition. I don't even have to call anymore. Now the CRM right. calls me. And it's called the call and whisper. And what it does, it literally, this is what it tells me. We just got a Medicare Facebook lead. Hit any key to talk to this lead. That's it. And so if I want to have a conversation, I can just hit one and then agent CRM will call that lead and you start the process while it's super, super hot. This is instantaneous, guys. All right. Yep. But let's just say Alex doesn't want to talk to me. Or let's say that Alex is a night owl and he's doing this at 12 o'clock at night and all this gets bypassed. Well, what it does, it's going to send this lead or Alex all, uh, it's going to send them a series of emails and text messages. And what it's going to do, it's going to warm up Alex to me. That's what I want. I want Alex to know that I'm real. So it's going to yeah. send Alex pictures of me, my office, my team. It's going to let him know that I'm going to be calling him. And here is the number I'm going to be calling from. And then also, and you agents know this, in order for us to do our job effectively and compliantly, we need to collect a scope of appointment and we need to get a list of all your doctors and all your meds. Well, all that is done in this, in this in this series of emails and text messages. That way, when I do call Alex and we get a hold of him, Alex already knows what we need, we got to do. You know, I'm a busy guy. I don't have time to mess yeah. around. So at that point, Alex should have his meds ready and it should have a list of doctors. That way I can gather that data. And I will tell you what happens a lot of times in these text messages, they're sending me that back via text. I hey, love that. Scared. They're all ready, ready to go. Oh yeah, they're ready. At that point, you get the data, start doing your research, and then you scope them and you go to work and go make money. So this is one of the many workflows that I have for you. Now, what I'm gonna share with our viewers, Alex, is what I call my snapshot okay if you focus right here on column b i've got you're like why is there so much data in here well i've got all this stuff that regardless of what type of agent or what line of business you sell you're going to get everything i've created throughout the years so this is my medicare snapshot i have one for aca uh, we have one for life one for auto one for home and then i'm going to share a bonus one that you get if you're a recruiter but here's what happens, guys. You see these tags right here? When you get a client, Alex comes to me, I'm going to tag him. Okay. Why do I want to tag him? I want to know what I've done for him. More importantly, if I sold him an MAPD, there are things that I want to do with him after the sell. Okay. I want to cross sell. Okay. Let's just, I want to cross sell indemnity plans. So I've created an indemnity workflow that Alex is going to be put into because what I'm able to do is based on this tag, I can create a smart, is a smart list, Alex? Smart yep. search? Smart list. Yep. So I, can, I can create a smart list and tell agents here, go find me all my clients that have this tag. Then I grab them, I click them, and I dump them into a workflow that's going to go to work for me and make me money. Okay. Now, what if I sell Alex a Medicare supplement? Well, he goes into a different workflow, okay? Mm -hmm. That workflow is going to be a workflow for, for dental and vision, for life insurance. It's something a little bit different. So these tags are important, all right? The other thing that I do is I put them into pipelines, okay? They must go into a pipeline because I need to know where Alex is in the stage. So in other words, if I sell Alex UHC, 
and uh, I enroll him or uh, I complete the application, he goes into a stage. So if you look at here, here are all my stages, guys. So a new lead comes in. I made contact with him. I called, but I never got a hold of him. I booked an appointment. He pulled a no-show. Not good, Alex. We had an appointment. <laughs> missed it, man. Um, I, I, I have an application pending. You know, these applications, mm -hmm. yeah, they get issued 99% of the time. But still, I want to make sure that they get approved. I made a sale. Did I cross-sell life? Did I, did I sell mm -hmm. the life? So I, I know where he's at in this stage. The other thing I that love I that you have this the cross sell of life as an automated thing inside the pipeline. So now you're just you're taking people who are signing up for Medicare and then you've already got the entire process built out to cross sell them another insurance policy with an agency. Area. That's brilliant. No, you and you and you got you guys. You know, now in our world, you're not supposed to do it at the time of the appointment. That's why I have it for after the appointment, after you yeah, have this brilliant. The other thing that is huge, Alex, is especially for you guys that are out there building a book on ACA, is these people age into Medicare at some point. So mm -hmm. what it does is I've created a workflow that if you enter the date of birth for your ACA book of business, it waits for them to turn 64 and a half. It grabs them and it puts them into this turning 65 flow. And then what it does is start sending them a series of emails and text messages, reminding them to enroll in Medicare, what the process is, what they need to do enroll in Medicare, and then what they need to do with me. So, you know, I'm, I'm nurturing a, a I'm, I'm mining. My backyard is what I'm doing. Okay. Um, so I've got these pipelines. I've also got these templates for you. Okay. One of the things that that is a, uh, not an issue, but it does take up my time is, Alex, if I enroll you with United, mm -hmm. at some point, you're going to call me with needing their phone number, their website, right. their provider search, maybe the formulary list. So I've created emails. Once I know what, what plan I put you in, I stick you in here to this plan. And then what it'll do is send you an email and a text. And it gives Love you it. all the data. So I've taken a bunch of work off my plate. So instead of reacting to him, I'm being proactive in sending him this data. Look at all the workflows I've created, Alex. Wow. wow. I tell you what, guys, amazing. this has taken hours, hours. And it's taken a lot of work with the agency and support staff to get these things to work beautifully. So I'm going to share. You know, I'm sharing the one here, which is the front side of things where you're trying to acquire a client. But as you guys know, acquiring the client is not everything. Acquiring a client is half of the equation. Yes, we make yeah. money when we write them. But if we lose them, we have to pay that money back in the form of a chargeback. Okay. So we want to build our book. We want to retain our book. So I've created some flows. And I'm going to share those with you now. Okay. We're going to get out of here. All right. So these are all the workflows. The One of the flows wow. that I'm going to share with you is the AEP reminder. This is where we lose a lot of clients or we gain a lot of clients, okay? So I wanna remind my book that AEP is coming up and that, that I can help them with either staying in the same plan or possibly moving them to a better plan. So this AEP is reminder is huge. Now, let me tell you this, Alex. I also remind them, don't you dare talk to another agent. <laughs> oh yeah i'm like oh i warned them i said you know they don't you know they want to move you regardless of whether you're in the best plan possible that other agent wants to move you okay yeah. so they may not have your best interests at heart okay i already got you i can keep you in the same plan or move you let's talk about your needs and and if it's necessary Okay. A lot of times they, they just forget some of the benefits they've got. And another agent comes in and he's all excited about some new benefits. I'm like, you already have them. You didn't have to leave right. me. Okay. Right. So I share that with, with, with our agents. Here's another flow. Look at this one right here, guys. Alex, this is huge. Now, oh, what is money maker? It's a money maker. Heck yeah. If you look at this, Alex, if you have a final expense book of business and they do not have Medicare with you, any kind of Medicare. What it does, it, it reminds them of 
the AEP season coming up. And that's an opportunity for you to get there in front of them. So th this is huge for you agents out there that have a final expense book of business. Those are the easiest yeah. ones to work with. Um, okay, let's get going on here. I got a couple more that I want to share with you that I think are huge. Number one is, well, these two together, guys. All right, so I talked about retention. All right, so I created a flow or a workflow for what I call post-enrollment, all right? So if they have an MAPD, a Medicare Advantage plan, then what I do is I put them into this post-enrollment and it's designed to do a couple of things. Number one is designed to help me cross-sell hospital indemnity, which I call HIPS, okay? But it's also designed to keep these people in here. All right, check out what I did, Alex. As this workflow is coming up, yeah. So, I mean, on, this is for people who are watching this. Lewis is giving you the lead generation warm up, the new client, the cross sell, you know, keeping them sticky. I mean, this is literally a Medicare business in a box you put together here. It, it is, guys. It is because you want you. I know agents. I'm one of you guys. All right. We sell a policy. We're, we check out. We go on to the next one. Well, you can't check out. You've got to retain right. that. OK. And so what this does it helps your clients stay with the policy you sold them. So you'll see here, I'm immediately starting a cross sell for HIP. Okay, so I send them an email. I send them a text message. I even send them a video from the carrier that they created that explains oh, nice. this. Beautiful. All right, I wait a couple of days or almost 15 days. Then here's what I tell them. Alex, you've got to make your initial appointment with your primary care physician. I remind them that. Nice. All right. Next thing. And, and there's a, there's a couple of reasons number, you, that they want to do this. And, and we know mm -hmm. as agents know, Hey, you got to let them know that you have a new plan. They start building the yeah. old plan that you had. And then you start having claims issues. Claims get denied because you don't have coverage and it, it creates a bad experience. Um, and also yeah. the pharmacy. So I try to tackle that up front. Second thing that I do is I start reminding them about all the benefits that they've got. So I'll send nice. them dental reminders. Life insurance reminders, over-the-counter reminders, vision reminders, hearing benefits reminders. What about the gym membership? I you know I tell them, hey, you 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 got a gym membership? Are, are you enrolled? I'll help them with that one. Uh, the PERS device, personal emergency response system. This is the I have fallen and I can't get up. Mm -hmm. Okay, I remind them it's it's free. Uh, transportation reminder. I also tell them that I accept referrals. Okay. Love it. I love referrals. Um, and then and in October, it automatically takes all these people and it adds them to the AEP reminder workflow. Yeah, man. This is running your entire business for you. It, this is like two or three people. And guess what? Yeah. Those two or three people are costing. For oh me, a lot no more than 97 a month. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. That's it. You can't hire anybody. You can't. I can't even get my kids to do laundry for ninety-seven bucks a month. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. So that's that's one of my flows. I also have a flow similar but different for people with med sup and prescription drug plans because they they are a different type of client. So I've got that one, um, guys. So, I, so I, everyone who signs up using your link gets gets all this stuff included. All they have to do is go into those workflows and make sure that where it says, you know, Louis Moreno, it's got their name now, and they just swap out your contact info for theirs, and then it's ready to go. The entire business in a box for warming up new leads, nurturing them, keeping them sticky, upselling them, everything is built out and ready to go. You're giving the entire Medicare business in a box away. It is. It is. And I will tell you guys, here is one of the things that over time is that we're going to lose. And, this, and I use this number and it's a little loose. I'd say that an average agent has about an 80% retention ratio, which means mm -hmm. they're going to lose 20%. You can't control a couple of things. You can't control them relocating. You can't control them dying. Okay. That happens. But the one thing you can control is you want to keep another agent out of the house. Right. They show up and they're like, no, no, no. Look, my, my agent texts me. He, I mean, they don't know that the CRM is doing it. They think it's coming from you. Right. But 
you're staying in contact with your shirts. You're, 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 they, they don't forget about you. And on top of that, you're reminding them about AEP. And that's where a lot of agents come out of their hole. They, they, they just say it's a, it's a crazy time of the year. And it's letting them know they don't need to talk to another agent or call 1 800 number. Okay. They, you can take care of that for you. Remember, these seniors just, they, they forget. So, guys, you don't have to create this thing. It's all done for you. I just ask you one thing is take all of my stuff. And what you need to do is you need to customize it for you. This, this, yeah. is, this happens a lot, uh, Alex. They'll, they'll just put it into their, 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 uh, their agent CRM. You got to remember, it's got my email, my yeah. <laughs> phone number, my calendar, pictures of my office, pictures of me. And so, yes, all you have to do is swap that out and uh, super easy. Here's yeah. another thing I want to share, Alex. Okay. And you mentioned it. Okay. But I want to, I want to mention this again. So guys, I have tried a bunch of CRMs. Okay. I'm like you, I'm always looking for that next tool that's going to give me the advantage over another agent or agency. Okay. And so I have tried numerous CRMs and they're all alike. A lot of them have the same tools, but here's why I chose agent CRM. Okay. Number one is I'm not a tech kind of guy. I mean, I know enough, but now I, I know that I don't know enough. That's what I do know. And because I know that I don't know a lot of things, when it comes to the CRMs is you guys had a great support system. A lot of CRMs do not. A lot of CRMs are like side projects. You mentioned that for other organizations. Yeah. They just kind of create it, put some stuff in there. Like here, take off with it, figure it out. Well, that's not, this is not your side project. Is it actually, this is no. your baby. This is, this is it. This is core business right here. Yeah. This is all we do. This is all you do. So because this is all you do, you've created an incredible support system. And every day, five days a week, guys, not seven, but five days a week, you can jump in on a Zoom, okay? And I love doing that. When I have a problem or an issue or an idea, what I do is I hop into the Zoom. It's two times a day, five days a week. I hop in. I wait my turn. They're like, Luis, I get in there like, hey, this is what I want to do. Or I've got this and it's not working. Or how do I create this? And what they do is they they they, they do their thing. They, you give them access to your computer. And they work it. If it is a super complicated issue, what that what I do love is like a couple hours later, I'll get a loom video. I'll get a video explaining what they did. And they've done it yep. on my account. So it's already fixed. Plus, I get a video explaining what they did. So I don't know of any other CRMs out there that do that. And the price is only $97 a month. Guys, yeah. I'm telling you. If you if you have a secret to getting your kids to do the laundry for ninety seven dollars a month, email me. <laughs> but for ninety seven bucks, I have yet to figure it out. Um, the ROI and agents are always. If you don't know what ROI is, guys, ROI is the return on your investment. Mm -hmm. If you pay ninety seven dollars, I guarantee with my cross sales or even with my retention or the fact that you're nurturing your leads up front, you will get your ROI back with just one set. And if you yes. can't sell one a month, you got bigger problems. Yeah. Bigger problems. <laughs> but you go sell one Medicare Advantage, guys, you're going to make a $600 commission. So you're getting a one to six return on your investment. It's like going to the slot machine and I give it a hundred bucks and it gives me 600. Well, I'm not, a, I'm, I'm kind of smart, not the smartest, but if I put a dollar, oh, I put a hundred and I get six. I'm like, well, what if I put $200? Can I yeah. get 1200? I mean, it's just, but the beauty with this guys, it's a measly $97 a month. You get all the tools. And on top of that, you get all the workflows that I have created. Medicare, ACA, final expense, auto insurance, home insurance. And we've got a bonus. Okay. Yep. This bonus is for you guys that recruit agents. Here's a what a lot of people have been asking for this. And I'm saying, uh... I'm excited that you're giving it away. Tell me about your, your new agent workflow that you built out. It, it, it's a giveaway, guys. All right. So for you guys that are not recruiting agents, you can disregard this. But for you guys that are entrepreneurial and you're, you're building a downline of agents beneath you or below you, I created a tool because I do the very same thing. I recruit agents. I do not like to grab an agent 
and contract them and forget about them. That's what a ton of organizations do. Okay. It's like taking 10 guys and throwing them in a swimming pool that don't know how to swim. Nine of them are going to drown and one's going to survive. Okay. I would back in the day, back in when I started in 1999, that's what happened to me. I got contracted and they're like, good luck. I'm like, what do you mean? Good luck. I'm like, yeah, good luck. Go find some clients and write them up. And I'm like, well, uh, okay. So I was lucky. Okay. But the other nine guys drowned. All right. So what mm -hmm. I created was, well, what I did is I don't want those guys to drown. I want eight to survive and I want to train them and support them. So what I did is I created a workflow for these, for these new agents. Hey, this is what you've got to do. And I've got a contracting video. I have a certification video and then I've got certification tips. And then I've created a heavy contract again. So I'm in constant contact with that agent because what I want is when that agent has certified and contracted or contracted and then certified, I want them to let me know so I can add them to my own training and support platform. Cause now I'm going to train them Love it. and I'm going to support them when I'm out, when they're out in the field. The problem is, is I kind of drop the ball on these new agents. You know, I get busy but I need them to tell me that they're ready to go because there's no system in place for that to happen. So they email me, they'll text me, Luis, I'm, I'm done. I'm ready to go now. I'm like, hang tight. I add them to our platform and now they start getting all of my training, all of my support. They get plugged in. Now they're learning how to swim. They're not going to drown. I have that workflow for you recruiters out there. All you got to do is sign up and I give it to you. And then you just tweak it out for whatever you need to do. And that's a freebie, guys. Yeah, I love it. So all you have to do, if you're watching this, like, what's my next step? Just click on the link below. That is Lewis's affiliate link. You get a 14-day free trial. After the 14 days are up, you'll get charged $97 a month for as long as you keep it. No long-term contract. Just keep it for as long as it's valuable. When you sign up and you log into your account, you're going to get all of Lewis's workflows and everything else he's created, the templates, the pipelines, all of it. You're going to see it in your account ready to go. What you'll do, we'll just go through there, edit it, swap out Lewis's info for yours, and then it's ready to go for you. If you have questions and need help, that's one of the things that we provide to you absolutely free. It's included with your subscription. We're here to help with live chat, email, the Zoom calls that Lewis mentioned, and we have a really, really active uh, support Facebook group for agents just like you so that we can work together to help you grow your agent CRM get it all set up and then grow your business. So, but the first step is just clicking the link below, sign up for a free trial. You got to do it guys. It's not an option. It is, I will tell you in this world, this is not an option. This is a must have tool for you agents and agencies out there. So take advantage of it guys. Everything will be down yeah. here. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you, Lewis. Yeah.